Can I get an amen? Amen. Can I get an amen? Amen. Can I get an amen? We've been looking for all night. So no matter what happens, we give a lot of credit to Buster Douglas for making this a big, big fight. Tyson trying to end it with one big shot again. He's down, he comes with the uppercut. Come on, brother, Buster's throwing shots back. Hey, look at this. Look at Buster coming back. Did he fight on the lights of Mike? I don't know, he's got him again. Oh, nice uppercut by Buster Douglas. I have to fight against this depression. I have to fight against this anxiety. I have to fight against this this poverty mindset. I have to fight against these generational curses that just plague me. I have to fight against the temptations of this world. I have to fight against my mind. I have to fight against these emotions. All my life, I had to fight. And I am fighting to this day. You have to use the strength from the struggles you had against the struggles you are having right now. This is how you gain your spiritual muscles. Because let me tell you, sweetheart, let me tell you, life is disruptive. Last week I was out um, eating with my niece. We were celebrating her 16th birthday, right? And we having us a good old time. And I get a phone call that my son was in an accident. Now he's okay, but it's a disruption. And we dealing with all kind of disruptions. I'm talking to a lot of people that's dealing with a lot of disruptions. We talking about death. We talking about sickness. We talking about divorce. What do you do when your life is disrupted? So you got to have God before the strike. And in the presence of adversity, that doesn't mean that God is not there. You know what? Can I be honest? Because I ain't going to talk about you. I'm going to talk about me. It was easier for me to just pray on something and not do nothing because I wanted a miracle. Okay. I just wanted a, a million dollar check to just come in the mail. You understand? I just need, I just want a miracle. But no, 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 sweetheart. God is calling you to deal with it and you're going to pray and you're going to seek him daily this is life sweetheart this is life and god cannot be explained he can only be revealed And I know it's hard because we are living in a time where opinions have devoured the truth. So you don't know. You just don't know. But I'm going to tell you, listen, listen. All I got is my experience. All I got are my encounters. And all I have. Is what I'm giving you right now. This is it. This is it. Pull up your earring. Take off your earrings, sweetheart. Roll up your sleeves. 
and be prepared to fight. This is what life's about. I know mama ain't tell you they trying to sugarcoat you. No, you got to get your mind right. You got to get your mind right. And be prepared to fight. Because the war, the war is here. And then it, it triples out into the, it, it seeps out into the environment. Get your mind right. Be, be prepared to fight. Don't, don't concentrate on where you at right now, sweetheart. Don't concentrate on where you at right now. Concentrate on who you are becoming. Because listen, I don't understand, sweetheart. It's tough. Listen. <laughs> the struggle, <laughs> sweetheart, is real. And let me give you this. I notice when, when I'm not focused on God, when I'm not, when I don't got my eyes on him, when I take my eyes off him, oh, I'm easy to get thrown off because the reality is real. The struggle <laughs> is real. And God is too. Mm. God loves you. He loves him some use, y'all. It's your girl, your big homie, TT. Thank you for allowing me to pour this sweet tea of love, inspiration, and motivation. Y'all tune in next week and see what God gonna do. I'm trying to tell you. I have no idea, but this, this I do know. Listen, you may see me struggle. You may even see me fail. Mm -hmm. You may even see me suffer. But let me tell you one thing, sweetheart. <laughs> let me tell you this. You will never, never see me give up. And I'm going to ride this thing till the wheels pop off, spin off, break off. Okay, so you're going to see this girl every Sunday. Y'all know what to do. Y'all be blessed. Bye.